busy, uh, busy time, but super excited that my dad was able to come home and, and is back home right now. Um, also took a quick trip, like a really, really, really quick trip to Orlando for the Funnel Hacking Live event. Did any of you go to that? Just type number one in if you were there. Um, if you were there, you probably saw me there. If you were not there, then uh, then you might have seen some. I see Michael Rodriguez. How are you? Uh, Michael is in a lot of uh, or in some posts that I did. So a lot of you saying uh, that you didn't make it. Let me show you real fast. I'm going to show you guys all because you know we've been building funnels, we've been crushing funnels. Let me show you something really quick. I wasn't planning to bring this and show it, but uh, but it's in my office, and I thought, wow, might as well. So check this out. Um, so I got an award at this event. Oh, got an award at this event, and it was the uh, eight figure funnel award. You might can see that. Um, so it says, you know, my name and it says eight figures and it's this, uh, it's this ring, which is actually really awesome. Um, it's very, very cool. So check it out. It says eight figures on it and it's a, uh, it's a four carat diamond ring. So really, really awesome. ClickFunnels gave me this. You guys know, I told you I use ClickFunnels. <laughs> uh, they didn't give me this for, uh, being an affiliate or whatever. They gave it to me cause I use ClickFunnels and I've done uh, built eight figure funnels through there. So it was really, really good. And it was a great experience. Um, gave me a couple of minutes to get away from home, which I needed to, uh, to refresh myself and, uh, and to get back to work. Um, what's exciting for me is, is that as we kind of build out our, our business and as we help you guys to build out yours, I'm always finding new things and new ways to help you have more success, right? And that's always been my goal. That's that's always been been my number one goal is to help you guys have more success. And so tonight, what we're what we're going to uh, what we're going to go over, okay, on the success connection tonight, which I think, so I can't zoom in a little bit, make it a little bigger for you, which I think will be uh, really really exciting for for most all of you anyway. We're going to talk about optimizing for mobile traffic, okay? Now, I did some numbers, okay? And I want, I want you guys to, uh, I, I did some actual checking uh, for, for my stats, okay? These are my stats, okay? And you know, I always share what I'm doing, I share my stats, I share my stuff, with you guys, because um, look, this is the this is the success connection. This is where I share everything that I've got, and I can give you as much as I possibly can to help you be successful. Now, if you can do me a favor, if you're a member of our success connection group, and there's people that are missing out on this presentation, remember I said go here and just type in and tell them we're getting ready to give away mobile opt-in. Um, I started a few minutes late here, but we'll be giving away our mobile opt-in software to one person here in the next couple of minutes. So uh, go ahead and share on Facebook, share it in our Facebook group, and just let people know that they can join us. We have about four, four well, no, now about 22, uh, 22 spots left. <laughs> so 22 spots are available on the webinar now. So we're going to fill it up again, which is awesome. Okay, so my stats. I want to show you something here. Um, when we went and looked at our traffic, okay, so just traffic coming in to our business, okay, so traffic coming into our business, what we found, and I did this this week because I knew I was going to be going over this with you guys. What we found was really astonishing, right? So what we found was as the, 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 the split happened between mobile and desktop, okay? So as the split kind of happened between mobile and desktop here, what we found is that for our traffic, okay, for the traffic we're getting, 78% was in, was mobile traffic and we're getting about 22% desktop, all right? So 78% of what we have coming into our business is mobile traffic, right? That's a huge opportunity because when we, when, when we talked about last week, optimizing for the type of traffic and then for the traffic source, right? How many of you were with us last week when we did that, just say yes if you were here last week. Okay, very good. Lots and lots of yeses. So that means lots and lots of people repeating and not missing out on the success connection. You guys are all very smart. Um, I'm actually going to be doing some pretty, uh, pretty crazy stuff tonight. Um, 
I'm excited. As you can tell, I'm a little bit more excited. My dad is home. I'm feeling a little better. Um, I don't have to run to the hospital right after the webinar. I can go across the street to my parents' house, which makes me uh, feel a little more comfortable, right? So, um, so excited about that. So anyway, 78% of our traffic is mobile. What you want to do is you want to learn how can we how can we make the most money possible from this mobile traffic. Now, typically. Okay, typically, not all the time, but typically, okay, these types of things work better for what we call lead gen offers. Okay, how many of you know what a lead gen offer is? Just say yes if you, uh, if you are. Okay, very good. All right, okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay, so lead gen offers literally are just offers like this and it's a page, and all it asks you for is like, you know, an email address, okay? And that's it, nothing else. And then it goes on along and, you know, off we go, and then there's, there's the, you know, there's the kind of light at the end of the tunnel, right? There's the, the money. Over here on desktop, you can convert to sales pages. Now, you can still convert those to, to, to offers like that are just lead generation, but these over here, here is where people have to maybe you call it click the buy button right click the buy button so people are more likely to click the buy button on desktop and they're more likely to just put in an email address when it comes to mobile can anybody tell me why that might possibly be that way anybody want to just put that in the chat box okay very good exactly here's the thing when you are when you're on a mobile device, oftentimes it's difficult to buy something. Another reason for that is, and we'll pull my phone up in just a little bit. Another reason for that is this: I don't trust, even me personally, I don't trust putting my credit card information into this phone nearly as much as I do this computer. And I don't know if there's actually a good reason for me to feel that way. I'm not a hundred percent sure yet. But what I do know is that. If anywhere in here it stores me typing my my credit card number somehow in some kind of something in this phone and I lose my phone and some crazy person knows how to access that I feel like they can get my credit card information and so I just don't want to do it <laughs> so when I buy stuff it's rare that I actually buy it online now I might see it on my phone I might access it on my phone then I will go if I want to buy it and I will get on this computer and buy it because I feel like this computer isn't going anywhere. I'm not going to lose it. It's bolted down in my house, right? So when we, when we see that, we have to have a little bit of this like aha moment. And that is, oh my gosh, if, if all this traffic, okay, and we talked about this last week, all this traffic is coming through on a mobile device, then our chances of making a sale right at the point of contact, right? So right at the point of contact, right when instantly when somebody is, is, is clicking on your link, we're not going to get as much of a sale as we would over here on a lead gen page. So why do I tell you that? Well, because you always want to optimize your process for, again, where your traffic is coming from. Well, tonight what I'm going to do is I will talk to you guys. I, I told you I would do this. I'll talk to you about mobile opt-in. Now, I want to be very clear, very upfront, because you guys know that that's how I always do. Um, this is a software that I built, and, and I released it. I think it was two and a half years ago. That I, that I actually released this to let other people use it. Um, I've used it for quite a while, probably going on seven years now. Um, but I released this about two and a half years ago for other people to use it. I am going to go through my process right now for how we just figured out, this is insanity. We found a lead gen offer, okay? We found a lead gen offer that is paying us $1.50 per lead, okay? So this is paying us $1.50 per 
lead. I want you to think about this, all right? We buy solo ads. So we buy the solo ad traffic, okay? When we buy the solo ad traffic, all right, we send that traffic through and it hits our page, all right? To get that traffic to our page costs between 40 and 50 cents. Okay, depending on, again, how many clicks we buy and all that kind of stuff, okay? So if we buy a lot of traffic, we pay a little bit less for it. All right, here's where the, here's where the good part comes in, okay? If this is our page, okay, this is our page, all right, and it has this opt-in. All right, so here's what's happening. People are coming in. They opt into my page. Once they do, I send them to this lead gen page. Okay? For this offer. I'm going to tell some of you what this offer is tonight. Okay. So, I send them to this offer. If they opt in and they convert here, I get paid $1.50. All right. Well, here's what we figured out. Okay, we figured out how we can get opt-in rates over here of close to, let's just say on average, because there's bad traffic sources and good traffic sources and all that stuff. And so let's just say on average, we can get 40%, okay? So we can get 40%. Let's do the math real fast on how this particular funnel works. If 40% of the people opt in right here, and let's just say we, we, we throw a thousand clicks, okay, through to this page, that's going to send 400 people down here to this lead gen offer. Now, the lead gen offer has been converting um, on average for most people at give or take about a dollar to a dollar 20 and 20 cents for everybody that hits the page. So literally, for every single one of these people that hits the page, it's worth about $1.20, okay? So that's just what, on average, what it's converting at. If I can spend $1.50 and I can make back $1.20, that means it's only costing me $0.30, cents, right? So in other words, I'm, I'm not making quite as much as I'm spending, but I'm making a pretty good bit. So let's... Let's just do the quick math. If we can get 400 people to hit that page and I, I get paid a dollar and 20 cents, that's $480 in revenue. That could be profitable if my click cost was more like 40 cents and it could be slightly under, I could lose $20. Okay. Okay. Um, but Here's the, the great thing. I have these 400 people on my list. So literally what's happening is I'm able to get to build my list for free. This week we put 73,000 subscribers and we got them free. We actually managed to optimize it just enough to get it at under, um, at actually a profit, okay? Now, here's the other insane thing. We took those subscribers, okay, and we mail. And we mail different offers. We're not even mailing my offers. We're mailing other offers, like all kinds of just CPA, CPA offers from CPA, from CPA networks, right? These subscribers that we're generating right now, $6,000 a day in profit. That's what we've, that's what we've averaged this week. $6,000 a day in profit. And it all comes, okay, from this particular funnel. It all comes from doing exactly what I've been teaching you which is, by the way, all of it is 
nothing but solo ad traffic, 100% solo ad traffic. Now, let me be very clear. I'm not only buying 1,000 clicks, right? To get 73,000 subscribers, we're buying a lot more traffic. We're not just buying 1,000 clicks. But here's the thing. We've taken it and we've made a process where you spend, we're spending nothing to get our, to build our list, right? Now, how is it and why is it that it's so profitable? Here's something that I did not, well, stuff that I didn't mention it to you, it's just that this is what happens. Now, by the way, I was telling you about mobile opt-in, okay, and that we'll talk about it. Here's the thing, I want you to all understand something. The mobile opt-in software is insanity um, in terms of what it has cost to keep it working because you'll see in a minute, there's a lot of things that break on a daily basis. But since I'm using it, I know that and I fix it, right? But I have one full-time developer on nothing but mobile opt-in, okay? So mobile opt-in is not free. It does cost something to use it, okay? So there is a fee to use mobile opt-in. Now, what I want you to be very clear on is that I don't get on here and just pound selling a bunch of my products. The only, I haven't even talked about mobile opt-in in two years on this webinar. The only reason that I'm bringing it up today is because by default, we started going through the solo ads and we started going through optimization and I saw people not really optimizing their pages for mobile and I start thinking like, okay, this makes sense. I really should show people what I'm using. So how many of you understand that I'll show you what I'm using, but that you do not have to go and buy it if you don't want to. Just say yes, if that makes sense. It also doesn't mean that you're not gonna ever be successful. It doesn't mean that I'm gonna be mad at you. It doesn't mean any of that. What it does mean is that if I'm gonna get up here every Thursday night and teach you what I'm doing, I have to be transparent with you. Just like I've been very transparent about the fact that I use ClickFunnels. And every at the end of every webinar, and tonight I'll do the same thing, I show you how you can get ClickFunnels, I give you some free funnels, and I share with you this is how I build my business, right? It's not because I want a dream car from ClickFunnels, okay? <laughs> Me, I already have all my dream cars. It's because, um, it's because that's what I really use. So I'll tell you a little bit about, uh, about mobile opt-in tonight as well so that you can see. Out of curiosity, because I'm gonna teach you a couple of new things in there, type the number one in if you have mobile opt-in, because I think a lot of you do, and type the number two in if you don't. All right, so if you have it, type in one. If you don't, type a two. Okay, so it's probably more people have it than don't. Okay, uh, let's see. So more people have it than don't. Uh, very good. So we have, but we still have a lot of people that don't have it. So for those of you that do have it, I am going to teach you, okay? I am going to share, because I'm using mobile opt-in for this funnel. I am going to do a workshop, a bonus workshop, just for mobile opt-in users, and I'm going to actually show you this entire, this whole thing, and I'm gonna show you how you can do this whole thing in, our, in a workshop, probably uh, next week. So what will happen is I'll post it right inside of mobile opt-in, and you'll be able to go register and attend it. So this is going to be a, bonus where I'll go through and actually show you this offer and the whole setup. But the point of this is, is that when we're optimizing for mobile traffic, okay, so when we're optimizing for mobile traffic, here is a problem. Here is a big problem, okay? And this is where, this is where a lot of people that build their list don't think. Let's just say that your list, okay, has 10,000 people on it. Okay, your list has 10,000 people on it. So you're really excited because there's 10,000 people on your list. You think you've done a really good job. You're phenomenal. And then you go and you send an email. Okay, and when you send that email, all of a sudden your heart drops, you feel terrible, and you say, oh my gosh, bad results. Okay, so the question is, and what a lot of people say is, well, why? Why is your, why are your results so bad if we're all doing the same thing? And the answer is one big word, quality. You see, 
And not all email lists are the same. There is a quality issue with a lot of email, uh, people that subscribe to your list. There's no real way for you to know how many of these 10,000 people are real. You see, you think that you know, but you don't really know, and here's why. There are three issues, okay? So three issues, three main, what we call pain points as email marketers. These are the things that you don't want happening in your business. Number one, you don't want the flat out fake email addresses. Because here's the thing, if you've got 10,000 subscribers on your list, but you wake up and you say, oh gosh, there, I, I can't get anybody to open it. Well, you know what? There's a very, very good chance that the subscribers on your list are not even real, right? There's people that are coming there and they're putting fake stuff in there and they do it on desktop computers. They also do it on, on your own mobile phones, meaning they just type in a bunch of gibberish and hit submit, right? Anybody ever seen that happen? All right, how many of you have ever done that? Type the number one if you've ever put in a fake email address just to see what the heck would happen. Yep, that's all y'all trying to hack funnels and stuff and see what the next page is and you put in fake information. Well, here's the thing. That's not the only problem. Some people will put in what we call secondary emails. So secondary email address. How many of you have a second email address that you it's yours, it's real, but you just don't really ever look at it. Just type the number two in if that's you. Yep, and the twos come flying. To see what happens is, is some people don't want to put, some people feel bad about just putting fake stuff in. So you have an email address that you hardly ever check, but you'll put it into boxes because what if you want to get the, the stuff? Like what if it is, what if I might send something you might want to go check and get? So you put in this other email address that you rarely ever check, okay? Here's the third one. This one really sucks. Typos. There's absolutely no, there's no way for you, okay, to know if somebody's putting in a typo or a secondary email address for that matter. This one is really a pain because it's a real email address, but nobody ever checks it. It's bad, bad quality. Typos. We can't really fix that because people have to type. And so they have to type and that creates a problem. And then fake email addresses, of course, how are you gonna stop somebody from putting a fake email address in? It's almost virtually impossible. On a desktop computer, it is impossible. And then there's the fourth issue, and this happens really from mobile, you know, for mobile users, a lot of time for mobile users, and that is mobile people like to click not type. Okay, what does that mean? Well, like I said, I think I mentioned this last week. It means that if I'm on my mobile phone, I am taught to just click things. I don't even have to type a passcode into my phone to get it to come on anymore. All I've got to do is just tap, and all of a sudden, my password is in and my phone opens. So we are conditioned to just tap. If we can't just tap it, then we just don't even want to deal with it, right? Because we're just like, forget it. I don't want to do it. I'm not interested in it. I'm watching this TV show. I'm doing this. I'm doing that. I'm busy, right? Well, here's what happens to your email list. When all of these things and all of these people, they funnel down into this big email list, okay? And you're over here spending your money to get that to happen. You're spending your money, okay? And when you're spending your money, you're looking at, anybody would, okay? You're looking at how much money is it costing you per subscriber, right? And that's what you're really looking at. How many of you look at that? How many of you, when you're building your list, think it would make sense to look at how much money are you spending to get a subscriber, yes? Okay, it's a very, very, very common way of looking at things. You're not gonna just not care you wanna know how much is it costing you to get a subscriber? I mean, in fact, if, if you could use the funnel I'm showing you, it, like, it's, it costs nothing, right? It's just free. But in most cases, you end up spending a little bit of money to get a subscriber. Here's where the problem lies, okay? 
let's just say and i'm going to give this is this is going a little advanced so if you're new just watch closely i'll back it back down but i want to show you where the problem happens for people okay it's that if i'm looking at it and i'm saying okay i spent let's just call it 100 dollars, and i got uh let's just say you know i got 200 subscribers okay then what that's actually telling me is I'm paying about 50 cents per subscriber, okay? Now, if I'm following my own rule of thumb and saying that each subscriber that I get, okay, these subscribers, okay, I'm making an assessment. I'm, I'm saying, in my opinion, these should be worth, we'll call it, one dollar per month okay now is that always the case no this is typically the goal this is the goal like mine's seventy three thousand subscribers i think that was let's see and that, that's typically like month one or so that you can get a much much bigger amount of money out of the subscribers so seventy three thousand subscribers six thousand dollars a day that's going to be about a hundred uh let's see 186,000 divided by 73,000. So see, I'm at like $2 on average on pace to do $2.54 per subscriber. But I don't, that will never hold up, right? Unless you're continuing to build your list. So eventually, the subscribers you got after 30 days are not making you a full dollar per subscriber. But this is typically our, our goal. Okay, here's where the problem lies. If we're doing this math, we're saying, okay, then we expect to make $200. And we only spent a hundred, so we expect to be very profitable. How many of you would agree on that math? Just say yes. Okay, I see lots and lots of yes. All right, here's where you run into a problem. If 10% are typos and another 10% are fake and another 12% are basically, we'll, we'll call them, you know, second you know, second emails, right, where people aren't really looking, you could literally have 30% plus or minus of your list that's just straight up fake. I mean, this is not a massively uncommon thing. This is not massively uncommon. Now, depending on how you set up your offer, meaning what are you giving somebody for free? What is your lead magnet? How bad do they really want it? Do you go in and give it to them on the thank you page even though they haven't double opted in, which is what most of us do? Well, of course we do because we don't want the, the hassle of the double opt-in. So what ends up happening? You end up with these big percentages like this, all right? Well, if we take 30% of our subscribers off, that's 60 subscribers. That's 60 people that are fake. That puts us down to 140, right? So we just lost what we would what we were counting on an extra $60. We lost that $60 in the fact that we are doing our math based on real or based on our total subscriber count, but we're not taking into account for the fact that there are a lot of fake subscribers on our list. Does that make sense everybody? Just say yes if it does. Okay? So we're all tracking, everybody understands that so far. Very cool. Now, what I wanna do is I wanna show you, this is from my, my mobile opt-in presentation um, a while ago, but what I really wanna do is I wanna share with you what I think anyway, and I mean, look, I could be right, I could be wrong, I could be all kinds of things, but normally I'm right and when it comes to this. This was, a, this was a, a, a diagram that really stood out to me when I was kind of going through this whole teaching list building, it was all about the hard work that is required to build your list. You see, it's not, there's always something fighting against you when you're trying to build your list. It, whether it's, you gotta understand how to build opt-in pages. Well, I gave you all those for free, and for those of you, uh, for those of you uh, that are on here uh, at the end tonight, I'm gonna give you those for free as well. Um, so you'll get them, uh, you will get, uh, some some free uh, landing pages as well that actually work really really well. Um, so you'll get them. Then we've got so we've got people like there's so many forces fighting against us. Whether it's our opt-in page, the optimization for it, 
How, what quality is the traffic? How much does the traffic cost? Can I figure out how to make an offer over here so that when somebody opts in, I can make money and I don't lose any money. So I'm not spending any money to build my list. There's so many things. Then there's the tech, right? I got to write my autoresponders and I got to write my email copy and I've got to find offers to promote. There's so many things. Uh, Tony says build redirects. It's what if my links aren't working and I don't have something like build redirects. There's just so many things that are fighting against us, that building a list is literally like pushing a ball up a hill. I mean, it legitimately is. Now, the good news is, is once you get the ball at the top of the hill, there's this momentum that takes over because once we've got a list, we can send those emails. Once we send those emails, we get results. Once we get results, we get excited. Once we're excited, we're going to do more. And that ball's going to grow and grow and grow. And it's a snowball effect and it's momentum. And honestly, sometimes you can't stop it. I mean, if you've got an autoresponder series that's set up, um, unless you are just crazy and you go in and delete your account, it will continue to make money for you until it stops running, right? So getting to the top of the hill is the major point of, of, I guess, pain, right? It's the major pain point. And it, what really, really, really irritates every one of us is that one of those big, big problems that we have getting this ball up the hill is the fact that people give us fake email addresses and we don't have control. How many of you have always heard that he who controls his business controls his destiny? Just say yes if you've heard that before. Right. I see lots and lots and lots of people. You see, not all businesses can can have total and complete control. For instance, let's talk about Facebook Messenger. I'm a big proponent of Facebook Messenger, but I've always told all of my students, I have a lot of people that use auto engage. I've always told them, I'm like, listen, we have a software that works. But if Facebook ever says this software can't work anymore or we don't allow this anymore, we don't store anything. It's all stored on Facebook. They control it. They own it. It's theirs. And so, yeah, we can leverage it and we can use it, but it may not last forever. What happened? This week, Facebook said, no more bots, no more messenger bots for right now because of this whole data thing that's going on that has nothing to do with you and I, but it has everything to do with Facebook reacting to a problem. So that means new people can't even use messenger bots right now at all. People that's, that have it right now can, but nobody new can, right? And there's no promise that Facebook won't, Erase them all one day, right? The thing with an email list is you control it. I still have my email list from 10 years ago, right? And it isn't going anywhere. And that's the reason why email makes so much sense, but we need to control the quality of those subscribers that get on our list. So quality matters and size does not. I want you to all write that down because I don't do, you know, a lot of times I get on here and I'm drawing all the time and I don't focus on the, I guess, the nitty gritty of some things where I don't talk about this enough, where quality matters, size doesn't. It doesn't matter how many people are on your list. What matters is, are they good subscribers? I'll show you an example of why. This is old, old, old. This is back when I promoted something from ClickBank. I hadn't done that. And you, you can see this is from 2012. It's one of the first emails that I sent. But I want you to look at something, okay? I want you to look very closely. You can see that on February 22nd, I'd made no money in this ClickBank account, none. And then on the 23rd, I made $4,400. The 24th, I made $5,100. And the 25th, I made $2,100 for a total of $11,816 in that week, right? And you can see, look, I gave you some more screenshots. You can see this was a brand new account. This was me just trying to figure out how to do something on ClickBank I'd never done before, okay? How many people do you think I sent an email to to make $11,816.60? Somebody put it in the chat box. Just guess. All right. Somebody said $100,000. Somebody said $120,000. Somebody said $22,000. Twenty dollars to $30,000. $76,000. $80,000. So I see a lot of high guesses. I see some really low guesses. $150,000. All right. Well, Check this out. Here's the email that I sent. I mean, this is the email. Look, February 23, 2012 at 10, 13 p.m. I saved the email, the screenshot. I was, I, I had no clue I would be talking about it six years later, um, but it was just something that blew me away. 
Look at the quality of the subscribers. I had 9,900 subscribers and I made over, almost $12,000 literally within a couple of days of sending that email. That is quality. You see what I'm saying? There's a difference in having a big, big email list. I have friends that have huge email lists. They don't make any money. They just blow money just trying to send emails to a bunch of people that have no clue who they are, no clue why they're on the list and all that stuff. It's crappy. Half of them are fake, bots and all this stuff. Mine were real. That's I made $26.08 every time somebody clicked on the, on the link in the email that I sent out. So imagine if you were if you're building your list and it's only costing you a dollar per subscriber, but you're making that dollar back. So it's costing you nothing. And then you end up getting $26 for every every single time somebody clicks on the link when you mail your list. It's all about the quality of the subscribers, right? That's where money is made. So where is the traffic? This is something, these are some stats that I want you guys to write down because I always think it's important to visually see things ingrained it in our brain so we know, okay? So this is all about education. This is not about me selling you a mobile opt-in software. I'll let you buy a mobile opt-in at the end, but you need to know this stuff anyway. This is not like, let me see if I can make you think so much about mobile that you want to buy my software. I could care less. The point is, is that you need to know this for your business, right? Right, this is important stuff. 60% of online traffic is coming from mobile devices. It's projected to eclipse 75% by 2019. We're talking about, what, a few months? Here's the important part. We're already seeing 78% in our, in our business coming from mobile traffic. So we've already eclipsed all of these numbers. This was data that I got off the internet. Look at this, email opens. Mobile now makes up the majority of people opening an email. 51% of emails are now opened on a mobile phone. You think it's important to know how to deliver emails to a person's phone? Well, 51% of all emails are being opened on mobile phones right now. So if you could deliver an email into this mobile phone and know that you've got the right email address for the person, that's where most people are being active right now. 68%, think about this, 68% of all of Gmail and Yahoo's emails are being opened on mobile phones. So you got the two largest email, free email service providers in the world. And they are almost 70% of their users are opening the emails on their mobile phones, right? Pretty incredible stuff. Like that is mind blowing because that's where people are checking their emails. Seven out of 10 shoppers are likely to make a purchase because of an email that they opened on their phone. So remember I told you that oftentimes people will open it on their phone, look at it and say, okay, save it and come back to it. Important stuff, very, very important, right? And look at this. This is the part that makes you money. You guys know that I always talk to you about analytics and stats. I want you to read this. I'm gonna break it down for you one by one. All right, it says, 23% of mobile emails are open more than once. So what that means is if you sent an email to your list, okay, of all of the people that open the email on their phone, 23% of them are likely to open that email twice, meaning open it more than once. Now, when that happens, there is a 65% increase in the chance of them clicking on the link in your email. Do you guys see that that means more money? Because as I showed you when I drew this, the clicks generate the money. Opens don't make you any money. So everybody write in the chat box, clicks make money. That's, I want you to ingrain that in your brain because sometimes people are so obsessed with how many people open their email, they don't think about the fact that opening the email is only the first step. Clicks make money, okay? Clicks make money. Very, very, very important. Uh, aspect to remember. I see tons and tons and tons and tons of people saying clicks make money, clicks make money. I should make a song. I'll, I'll hit up Chris and, and we'll make a rap song about clicks making money. So um, I can't rap. Don't worry. But the, <laughs> I know it's, it's very sad. Um, but 65% more likely to get a click means you have a lot better chance of you making a lot of money, right? From your mobile campaigns. 
And then email value. This is something that's very important because of the fact that more people are clicking, okay, and they're clicking more times when they open emails on their phone, the value of a mobile email subscriber is worth almost double that of somebody that's checking on their desktop computer. Think about that. That means if we can get email addresses out of mobile phones, if we can just get the email address that you have stored in your mobile phone, and we can send emails that we know are gonna be delivered right here to your mobile phone, we, will, we should be able to get double the revenue out of our email list because it is a mobile subscriber checking the email. Does that make sense? All right, I see lots and lots of people saying yes. So that is the reason why I'm so, I'm so into the, I, that's the reason why I want to share this with you because 80%, I mean, by the end of this year, mobile users are expected to be over 2.2 billion. That's 80% of the internet is going to be accessing their mobile phones to access their email. That is incredible. Those are numbers that you have to know if you want to be successful on the internet, right? And like I said, building quality lists is important. If all of your traffic is online, you need to focus on that. So how many of you have seen one of these little web forms like this? We build these all the time, right? Say yes. Okay, very good. Everybody saying yes. Here's the problem with these. They allow you to lose control of your business. Think about that for a minute. You lose control of your business because who actually controls your business in this scenario? That's right. Everybody's saying the user, the person that comes to the website, because if they give you a fake email address, you're screwed. If they use make a typo, you're screwed. If they give you a secondary email address, nothing you can do about it. You lose control over your business. So you're out there building your list, doing the best you can, and at the final point where, where the wheels start to turn and things start to happen and your business is being built, you lose control. You've got control over everything, how you get the traffic in, the pages you build, the offer you give, the free stuff you give away to do it, all of that. And then it all comes down to that little person's hand typing in the wrong thing. You lose control of your business. And that is something as a business owner, and if you were looking to build a profitable business, you just simply can't do. This is a problem. Fake email addresses and all of these typos result in stats that look like this. These are my old stats, right? From when I built my list. I want you to look at this. 131,000 emails sent. Only 613 opens and 74 clicks. How many of you would agree that those numbers are terrible? Just say yes. As you can see, I've come a long way from those terrible numbers. They're not that bad anymore. That is insanely bad. We barely got a half of a percent of the people on our list to even open it. So I came up with a better way. And about five or six years ago, I built mobile opt-in for myself. I want you to look at these landing pages. What sticks out to you as missing on these landing pages, right? Just put it in the chat box. What's missing? A lot of you that have mobile opt-in are answering. There's no place for somebody to type. There's no place for the user to type anything in order to get on your email list. What I built out was, you'll see those big buttons, the square boxes, when somebody taps on their phone, they tap that button. We actually, mobile opt-in goes into their phone, gets their email address that's stored as the default email address in their phone, and then puts it in your email list. Now, you have guaranteed, one, there's no way, I want you to understand something, it is impossible to get a typo. It is impossible to get a fake email address and it is impossible to get a secondary email address because we are getting the email address right out of cell phones. Not only that, we address the problem of users having to type on cell phones when they don't want to. All they have to do is tap a button. And by tapping the button, we're able to get their email address. Now Patrick says, so is it legal? Now how many of you think that I would do anything that is illegal and then blast it to a thousand people? <laughs> Not gonna happen. 
Um, there's just no need for me to do something like that. I need to stay around to take care of my dad, my family, my wife, my dogs. You know how bad Chloe is? Alexa would flip out if I wasn't here to help with Chloe. <laughs> no, no. Uh, 100% legal. I'll show you the process. I'm going to show you how to do it in just a second. It's 100% legal. And in fact, there's a reason why, and I'm going to let you guys guess in just a second, why do I get better open rates when I use this process? Look at this. These are old, old emails. I'm going to show you some of the stats, okay? Look at this. 38,000 emails sent. All you got to do is look down. 38,000 emails sent. 57 and a 57.75% open rate, okay? 57%, I want you to process that. This isn't on just a few emails. This is on 38,000. And I want you to look at the click rate. Look at the click rate. This is important training for you because you're gonna learn something that even if you don't get mobile opt-in, you can implement. And I've really forgotten about teaching this because I haven't talked about mobile opt-in in so long. Um, but look at the click rate. 27% of the people clicking. That is unheard of in this industry. It is unheard of. 27%. That is 10,000 clicks. I've only 38,000 emails that were sent. But that's just one of them. Look at this. You can see where it says mobile. Like my list name had mobile in it because I started building this mobile thing. Look at this. 48% open rate when we sent out 200,000 emails. Most, most people can't get that kind of open rate with 500 emails. Obviously, as you know, the larger your list grows, the less likely you are to have an extremely high open rate. This is 200,000 people with a 28% click-through rate. Remember, clicks make money. That's 28.7% click-through rate. Then you've got one like this, another mobile list, 105,000 people on this list with a 28% or close to 28% open rate. Now, you'll notice that there's still some bounces over here, okay? The reason that there's still some bounces is because a bounce means that the email was not delivered. And there's a couple of reasons why that can happen. One, it can be fake email addresses, right? Or two, it can be that literally Gmail or Yahoo or AOL well or whatever re rejected some of the emails from get response right so it doesn't mean that the email is fake it means that maybe get response which is where i was sending this from was having a delivery issue because we sent so many emails to aol or gmail or whatnot right so there's lots and lots of different reasons why you get a bounce rate but we had a 12 percent bounce rate on our other list and our bounce rate's looking at 1% or so um, when you use this. All of these email subscribers were built using our mobile opt-in software. Check this out, 91,000 emails sent, and I almost got a 30% click rate. That's 26,562 clicks. Now, I want you to think about something, all right? If we use these numbers, that 92,000 person email list, if we ended up getting that email list for free because we were using the funnel path that I showed you early, okay, which, by the way, that's not what I used to get this because it wasn't available, you know, back when I did 2012 when I did this or 15 or however long ago it was. Um, I have a new, you know, new offers now. But let's say we got our list for free and we sent 26,562 clicks to that offer that was making and is making right now today about $1.20 per click. That one email would generate $31,874.40 from one email to it, literally one email. Even if you paid 50 cents per subscriber, even if you were, were spending 50 cents to get a subscriber, you could literally send two emails and make all your money back and still be making a profit. There's a reason though that this works, okay? And I'm gonna, I'm gonna share it with you in just a second. Obviously, I'm gonna show you the mobile opt-in software real fast, okay? So we'll just kind of move this down here. I'll show you the mobile opt-in software. But what I wanna do first, okay, before I even do that, is I want to ask you why you think, okay, why do you think I get a better click-through rate, okay? 
I want you to answer that for me. I mean, I'm gonna hook my cell phone up here. So hold on just a second. I got to uh, plug my phone in. You're about to see my phone. Why am I getting a better click rate? There's a reason. Some of you should know this, although I'm guessing you forgot, some of you anyway. Let's see. Plug my phone in so you can see it work on my phone. You might also have to see me order my, my dinner <laughs> on Waiter app. I don't know if you guys have Waiter app, but I do and it's awesome. All right, let's see. Bring up my iPhone. I know. All the pictures of my wife is gonna, are going to show up in just a second, so hold tight. They're good pictures, though. They're not bad. All right. You want to see the picture of a headache? Check that out. That's my phone, right? That's the picture of a headache. 120 text messages, 80,000 emails, and 163 missed calls. How many of you want a headache? <laughs> That's a headache. <laughs> that is a terrible, terrible headache. Okay, so let me minimize that real quick so I don't look at it and get a bigger headache. And I'll show you, um, let's see, I'll show you uh, mobile opt-in real quick. And let me show you what one of what one of these pages look like. Okay, so let's pull it back up right here. All right, so what you're looking at right here is an opt-in page on my cell phone. Okay, so you're looking at my cell phone. This is showing up on the screen. This is this currently our best opt-in page. Okay, so this is our best opt-in page that I gave you for free for ClickFunnels. We've built it out in mobile opt-in now, so all of our mobile opt-in users are gonna get that completely, uh, it's, it's in there for free. So if you've got mobile opt-in, it's now a campaign that you can use for free inside of mobile opt-in. It's awesome, it's built, and it's already crushing it. Now watch this. Here is why this works so well. Okay, so why am I doing this? You can see it on there. Somebody makes a selection, right? So they say, I need help with tech stuff. You'll notice, there's nowhere for them to type anything in, okay? So all they do is they click continue. Now watch what happens. This is where, and this is why mobile opt-in is far and beyond better than anything else when it comes to getting clicks for you. Watch what happens. When I click that, do you notice that it instantly opened up my email on my phone? Does everybody notice that? Just say yes if you see the email on my phone, okay? And you'll notice that it says, yes, I want help with my business. And then it says, hey, I want help with my online business. Please send me a copy of your new book on how to build my business, find profitable offers, and eliminate the tech headaches I've been having for so long. P.S., we'll send you the book once you press send on this email. Okay, here's what happens. Mobile opt-in opens up the email client on your phone. When you press send, okay, when you press send on this email, it will instantly subscribe the, this user, my phone, to your email list, okay? And it'll go to Get Response and Aweber. We're connected where it'll actually just push it right in to your email list uh, for whatever email client you're using. Here's why this works so well. I'm gonna ask you one more time, and I'm gonna give mobile opt-in away right now to one person who answers this correctly. If you already have mobile opt-in, do not answer this question, okay? Do not answer this question. If I pick you and you already have it, then I'm gonna like bill you again, <laughs> okay? I wanna actually be able to give somebody mobile opt-in for free tonight who answers this question. Why is it that using this process, the users, are more likely to actually click on what's in the emails that we send them. Just put it in the chat box, let's look. Somebody says, it's not fake. Uh, somebody says, no, uh, one tap to reply. Uh, let's see, user only has to click. Uh, let's see. 
I'm going to give you a, 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 a quick, I'm going to give you a very quick tip. It has nothing to do with anything I've said. Oh gosh. There's some, my nest camera is going off on my phone. Sorry. Okay. Has nothing to do with anything I've already said. All right. All right, let's see. I'm still reading your answers. Nobody has said it yet. That's close. All right, keep them coming. Somebody's about to get it for free. I have a feeling somebody is. Okay, I've got my winner that answered the question as close as you probably can answer it, okay? All right, here's why it works so well. In every other case, okay, in every other case, I'm gonna announce the winner in just a second. I got, I got the person highlighted. In every other case, when you're building your email list, someone types in their email address, presses submit, and they have, that's it, right? All of that happens on a web page. All of that happens on your opt-in page in ClickFunnels or wherever the case may be, right? And then they go and they open their email box and there's a bazillion emails and they have sometimes just forgotten that they even opted in to what you sent them or, or what you provided for them on, on the website because it's so impersonal. It's on the website. It's not in their email box. Here's what happens inside of here. If I ask you a question, okay, if I ask you a question, are you likely to respond to me, yes or no? Okay, I see lots and lots and lots of yeses. So here's what that means. I see tons of people saying yes. Here's what that means. It means that when we are, when we are responding to someone, they are more likely to pay attention to us than when we are initiating contact with them, okay? And Kissling says they are getting what they requested from you in their email. That was as close as anybody got. So Ann Kissling, we're going to give you mobile opt-in tonight completely free. Okay. Here's the thing. You are responding to a request. You are responding to them. They emailed you first. You're just responding. So while the open rate goes up because your email is now whitelisted, right? So a lot of you said that your email address is whitelisted. Okay. That makes sense. But the click rate is because they are engaged because you are now responding to them with your first email instead of initiating contact with them. Does that make sense to everybody? It's the psychology behind the process and that is why they click at a higher rate they don't click at a low rate they click at a high rate because in essence you are responding to them instead of writing them this arbitrarily unknown email and hoping that they will respond to you that is why mobile opt-in works so well now when you send this email okay so when you send it you'll see if this little thing says processing your request, all right, and then if you have it set up, which I didn't because I wanted you to be able to see this, it says we're processing your request, right? If they, if they don't press the send button, okay, so if they hit cancel, they see a screen like this that will redirect them to whatever offer you want them to be redirected to. What I've done is left it sitting there because I wanted to show you what the process looks like. So we're gonna show you real fast what actually happens with mobile opt-in. So um, would you guys like me to show you a real quick, like just real quick how to build one? I don't, it's taken me quite a while tonight to get through this because I'm not really doing the PowerPoint presentation. I'm actually trying to teach you what the, the mechanics and the whys so that even if you don't get mobile opt-in or you don't have it, you can still implement the training because that's really what this is all about. Um, so let's do a real quick, uh, we can just look at the one that I built here, okay? So when you build a, a page in mobile opt-in, it gives you a URL like this, okay? So it gives you a website address, much like ClickFunnels does. 
So you don't have to have your own web hosting or anything to use our pages. Uh, when you use the pages for mobile opt-in, they're literally just there. They're ready for you. They're done. All you've got to do literally is just copy and paste this and boom, you're good to go, right? So super, super simple. You can build that out. All right, so let's take a quick look at the page. So what we've done is mobile opt-in and the way that it's built is a lot like ClickFunnels, but it's just for mobile devices and it's with our mobile technology, right? So everything is built inside of our little editor here and there's a lot of stuff that you can customize. There's a lot of stuff that you can edit. There's a lot of stuff that you can play with, right? Um, you've got timers, right? So you can go in here to the timer and you can click on it and you can change. Does it start over every day or does it start over every time somebody loads the page? Um, if it starts over every day, when does the day end? So in other words, you can set your timer. You can make, change your colors. If we don't want that to be red anymore, we can make it green and we can make the background color different colors whatever we want that's if we have certain things in here so watch this we can make our timer green right um we could go in here and we could change the style we could have like a circle gradient here okay and then with that circle gradient we might i don't think we really want to do that probably put this in there we can do like this so check it out we have a circle gradient countdown timer um we can change to something like this, right? So this is the one where I can change like the different colors. So um, if we wanted to go through here and make this just black, right? We could do it. Now we have that timer on here. We can change the style of our timer just like we can change anything else on the page, right? You can obviously change your text, okay? So we can edit the text, the size of the text, whether it's to the left, to the center, to the right, bold or italicized, we can make things a link. We can change the color of the text if we just want it to be, you know, a different color. Um, basically, anything and everything, we can highlight it, right? So I'm gonna make my template now very ugly because I'm playing, like, uh, playing around with this. The thing is, is the editor works just like, really like ClickFunnels does, okay? There's not a whole lot of difference in our editor and what ClickFunnels has because we built this years, I mean, we built this years ago, um, but it was built using the same thing that, and the same idea that we want it to be very easy. You can also kind of rearrange things, you know, if you wanted to drag this above this, this down here, you know, you can make things bigger, all kinds of stuff, right? So all, all of that is in here and easy. The question is, how does it actually work? So check this out. All you do is you go over here to these campaign settings, okay? And when you go to campaign settings, this is your slug. So this is kind of like that URL that you have, like forward slash your, your name or your offer or whatever, all right? That's what you're putting in here. You can also use your own custom domain names if you want to. We give you this app.mobileoptin.com because, you know, if you don't want to have to go buy a bunch of domain names, um, why, why would you do that when you can just use art? I actually use all of these myself, all right? We'll kind of come back to some of these things, but you can enable uh, all kinds of stuff. You can turn on retargeting if you do a lot of Facebook advertising. That way when people hit this page, it uh, fires your pixel. Um, you can redirect visitors. So check this out. This is something that's really, really, really cool, all right? I don't know anybody else that does this any other software. If somebody comes back to your mobile opt-in page that has already opted in, don't you think it would be more profitable for you to just send them on to the offer that you're promoting and not try to get them to opt in again? I mean, doesn't that make sense to you? Why would you wanna make them opt in again if they've already opted in? Well, mobile opt-in can tell if they have opted in already and we can redirect them to an affiliate offer or your website or whatever the case may be, we can redirect them for you so that you make more money and you don't lose money, right? That's always the biggest thing for me is eliminating places where we can lose money. I'll talk to you about optimization in just a second, all right? So we have this, then we go down here and we set up basically our, uh, this is kind of like the settings to tell it how to put the email addresses in your email list. It's very simple. You connect your account, like 
your Get Response account or your Aweber account or whatever, you connect that with mobile opt-in, okay? So there's a, a button in here that let, lets you do that. Once you do it, it shows up here in this and you say, I wanna put the leads from this page in my Get Response account, and then you select your list. Which list inside of your account do you want the leads to go to? And you just select one, so I'll pick this one. Then you can say, if somebody opts in, okay, so if somebody actually opts in, redirect them here, okay? Or you can say, oh, you can always redirect them, meaning always redirect somebody even if they don't opt in. Does that make sense, everybody? So in other words, if you're making money, if you're promoting an affiliate offer, you may want to always redirect people, even if they don't opt in, just redirect them, right? Because you want to make money. If <coughs> If you're giving away like a free book or something and you want to make sure that you actually have people opting in before they get it, you say only redirect when it's a successful thing, right? When somebody successfully opts in. Does that make sense everybody? Yes? Okay. Lots and lots of yeses. So you have control over that. And then here's the thing. You get to control the email that shows up on the user's phone. So you guys remember when I opened up, when I clicked the button, that email popped up on my phone? Everybody remember that? Okay, well, this is where I write that email. This is where that email comes from. I get to write it. So if I were to write it and say, you know, no, like no, I don't want help with my business, right? If I were to do something like that, okay, and then I were to go in here and save this, all right, and then I go back to my phone, I'll try to, Hold this up, I'll try to refresh this. Um, now you guys can see what I saved. Check this out. My timer is, I haven't got my timer set, like alignment perfect, but you can see my timer is there, okay? I changed it instantly, took just a few seconds to do it. If I scroll down and I pick, on, pick one of these options and I click the continue button, all right, what's gonna happen is, even if I don't opt in, I want you to watch something. Let's say my email comes up. First of all, you, everybody see where it says no now? I've controlled that with mobile opt-in instantly. It says no, and so obviously it's controlled. But watch this, even if I don't opt-in, okay? Because some people will look at this and they'll say, eh, I'm not gonna send the email. So even if I cancel the email, it still redirected me to my thank you page. Does everybody see that? Here's the crazy part. Nobody can stop you from sending them to your thank you page if you want to send them to your thank you page. Mobile opt-in controls their phone. So when, when they click that button, we control everything on the phone, Android and iPhone. So what that means is, again, people will always get redirected through your thank you page, unlike when you see an offer on the internet and you look at it and you say, I don't want that, right? And you leave. You don't see the thank you page. You don't get sent to the page where people make money. But on this, again, if you click this button and you press the send button or you don't press the send button, we control, watch what happens. If I said, no, you know what? I'm not sending that. I don't want that for free. Doesn't matter. The first thing you're gonna see is whatever we want you to see. So let's just say we were giving away this free book Okay, but then we thought, well, if they don't opt in, we just want to send them to an affiliate link so we can try to make some money on that page that will pay us $1.20 a visitor almost, right? We could take all the people that don't give us their email address and push them to a different place and then keep the ones that do and send them to our thank you page. This is maximum optimization. Does everybody understand that? Just say yes, maximum optimization, okay? All through mobile opt-in, all right? All through mobile opt-in. Okay, so super, super cool. Uh, I see lots and lots of people saying yes, yes, yes. Now, you know that I like optimization. So here's what I did. You see down here where it says survey one? You can actually, once you build a page, unlike a lot of places that make it very difficult, you can click clone. And when you clone it, it will give you a second variation of it. And you can go in here and say, hey, I want 50% of my visitors to go to each one of these. So in this variation, Everything stays the same, okay? Everything is the same, but maybe you just want your, you know, maybe you want your, your timer thing to, you want to test it with red, right? 
So you just save it in red, and now you've got a version in red, and you've got a version that's not in red, and it shows 50-50, right? So I have it set up to show 50-50. Now, of course, the way the database counts those, it may not, um, since I've already been playing around with this and I'm kind of cookie to it. Uh, well, nope, never mind. Look, check this out. It's already live. Look. So I loaded the page, and all of a sudden I see the red one, right? So pretty cool stuff that you can sit there and refresh, and you can go from red to green, see? Red to green, red to green. So again, you're able to set up split tests. Now here's what I think is the most important part about this. So pay close attention. In the campaign settings, we can enable optimization. Now, this is where real money gets made because you can optimize, you can say, look, we want a thousand or a hundred, I will say a thousand clicks to come into this campaign. We're splitting them 50 50. So that means each one's getting 500 clicks. Does that make sense, everybody? Just say yes if it does. Okay. Each one gets 500 clicks. Mobile opt in will automatically, without you doing anything, it will automatically turn off the one that is not getting the best results. And you can tell it do you want to optimize for opt ins, meaning getting the most opt ins per number of people that visit the page? Or do you want to do conversion? Because we can actually track the conversions all the way, um, all the way to uh, to where we, you know to where we want it to go. So enable optimization. Okay, you can optimize for opt-ins, conversions, and clicks, and mobile opt-in will do it all by itself, which is uh, which is what I think is really good. And then you can see that it's already had one click because it's me. Right, so it says campaign has one optimization click, right? So you can go in here and tell mobile opt-in to do all of this stuff for you, and it will automatically do it. Now, I did not show you the ease of use, which is what I kind of always have built out in life. So check this out. You can go over here to create campaign. We'll call this DSC, and watch this. Once I create this, I have over here, a blank screen but there's a button over here that says templates and when you click that it brings up all of these templates that we have okay we have our survey template that's the one that you just saw we have our some of our funnels are built out in here right so like for instance uh, look at this we can select this and it will automatically build this for you now once you look at that it is literally automatically built for you you don't even have to do anything look Everything done. So click funnels or something, you can literally go through here, use this funnel, and it's 100% done for you, right? And all of it is there to where all you gotta do is click a button. You can also use some of these other templates, right? So these are templates that we've built out, like for instance, um, you know, this one, download my free report. Right. And then it, this, these are ones that you can go in and quickly edit. And these are ones that we've, that we've tested, right? This one is a little bit longer with a video. But the point is, is you don't even have to go in like a lot of things and build these out yourself. Because like you do real estate, we've got some stuff for real estate in here. We've got a ton of templates that are in here. And if you do e-com, we've actually got a lot of e-com templates in here that are already set up for like Shopify and e-com stuff so that you can go in and do that. If you happen to do webinars, I don't know if many of you do, um, but we have webinar funnels in here. I mean, we just have, we literally have hundreds of these. And then we have some different elements that you can add. So like you can add this particular element to the page or that element to the page. So we have elements and templates that are already built out for you. And then you can add images, videos, countdown timers, bullet point lists, text, Headlines, all of this stuff can be added by just simply using what we've already built. So you can build your own template from scratch. You don't have to use what I'm using. Um, if you go in here and just say, hey, I want to build my own, okay, you can do that from scratch. Watch. Um, we'll just call this my own. But I mean, it takes like three seconds to have something live. You just literally drag a container box over here, 
right? So this is literally you getting started. And then from inside of here, you just pick, like, what do you want your background color to be? Um, you can also use images that we already have. So like, if you want a template that's very patriotic, you can click this, put this in here, and now you've got your background, right? You can drag a headline over here, type up in here and say, you know, uh, I don't know, make money in America. I don't know, I'm just being silly. Um, we can bold all of that, right? And then now you've got that in there. You can add an image right here if you wanted an image there. You can add a countdown timer to it. I mean, you know, you can do whatever you want. You can add your mail to box. So this is the box that tells people to subscribe to your list. And you can go in here and change this all up. The words can be that color. Uh, the background could be like really, really ugly or it could be like Christmas. You could change uh, what it says, you know, get it free. Um, you can change the size of the text to make it bigger or smaller. You can change the style of the button, make it a little smaller. You can give it a dotted border, maybe a dashed border. I mean, there's just all kinds of stuff that I mean, you can add an icon to it, save it. Now people click that button and that's the button that makes people opt in, right? So literally, you can just build from scratch whatever you want. Now, the other thing that mobile opt-in does have, and I'll show you real fast, is stats. So you'll notice that over here, um, you can click on any of these campaigns. Like if I click on this, do you see the stats over here? Uh, let's pull this one. Do you see how this has stats? And it's showing you the stats of each version of this, okay? So it's showing you the stats of each version of it. All right, now, the one other thing that it does and then we'll wrap up this demo because there's so much going on in here. The one other thing that it does is you can actually make it work with ClickFunnels in two different ways. The easiest way is right here. You would promote, always promote your mobile opt-in page link and you can go in here and you can tell it that if somebody visits this URL from a desktop computer to send them somewhere else. So watch this. So if we tell it to send them to Anthony Morrison, well, let's see, anthonymorrison.com, if they visit this page from a desktop computer, and then we save it, all right? And then we go back to campaigns, and we go to this page, and we copy it. We will end up going to anthonymorrison.com not to mobile opt-in because this is not a mobile device and it wouldn't make any sense. But if you were to go to that URL right now on your phone, you end up on the mobile opt-in page. Does that make sense to everybody? Just say yes. Okay, so what that means is you can build out both a mobile and a desktop friendly version of your pages. And this works on iPads, tablets, Android, iPhone, anything mobile, right? Anything considered a mobile device, mobile opt-in works on. Um, and there's some other really cool stuff in here. I mean, for people that wanna like build campaigns for other people, you can do that and sell it to them. Um, all kinds of stuff. But most of you are probably interested in building your own email list. I use this in conjunction with ClickFunnels so that I can get better optimization more clicks from my emails, and essentially just make more money off the mobile track. Does that make sense, everybody? And all the pages form fit, they put, everything looks perfect on a mobile device, on a desktop computer doesn't work worth a flip, so that's why we have it built in to redirect, okay? The ability to control somebody's phone, make them see a thank you page, make them go to an affiliate link, it's pretty phenomenal stuff, right? Um, it's not something that, that we have typically in the past ever been able to do. All right, so let me pull back up this. So first of all, for those of you that don't have mobile opt-in, okay, if you don't have it, how many of you feel like it's something you might would actually want? Type number one in, if that's you, all right? Now I already told you it's not free, right? Tons of people on here paid for it. Um, I considered doing a, somebody said I'd buy it again. Who said that? Vic did. 
Big, don't buy it twice. I considered doing a uh, a discount on it because, but I've never done discounts on our products because I like to maintain the integrity of everybody else that bought something. Nothing irritates me more than when I see people sell something and then four months later they've wasted all their money or something, and then they turn around and they say. I'm going to give you a 50% discount. And then it's like, well, what happened to all the people that just bought it? You know, I mean, you would agree with me on that. Like, it's just not what I prefer to do. So here's what I am going to do. I'm going to tell you up front. For those of you that enroll in it tonight, and we're not, that literally my links are, are specifically my links, right? They're not, this is not like the open link that you can go get on mobile opt-in on the website members area and all that stuff. This is specific for tonight, okay? So here's the thing. Um, what we're going to be able to do is I'm going to do a workshop with you, okay? So I'm going to do a workshop with you that walks you through the funnel that we're using right now to generate that revenue. I'm also going to tell you which offer it is that we're using, okay? So I'm literally going to give you the funnel and the offer, which is probably the most important thing. Um, and show, I'm gonna walk you through building it out in mobile opt-in so that you can go and do the exact same thing that I'm doing right now on the one that we're making $6,000 a day on. Um, I will record that presentation for you and send it to everyone that has mobile opt-in that is on this webinar. So other, it's not gonna get posted in mobile opt-in. I'm only going to give it to the people who are on tonight's webinar and have mobile opt-in. If you join mobile opt-in tonight on tonight's webinar, you will also get it. Here's what that will do. That will cut down 80% of the people and then I won't oversaturate the, the basically the offer that I'm giving you, right? In other words, the funnel that I'm using, I'm not gonna have a thousand people just because we have a thousand people that have mobile opt-in. There will be X number of percentage that were on this webinar tonight and then X number of percentage that get enrolled in mobile opt-in tonight. And that's my bonus to you that I wasn't, I was sitting around trying to think of what can I do because I want to, I want to be able to help everybody out. But I know that I've sold this software in the past. I can't in good faith discount it because it's unfair to the people that have bought it. And so I try to come up with where can I add value to everybody, give you more value than anybody ever got when they bought this. And, um, and then, of course, be able to give you um, ongoing value. So that's what I, you know, kind of what I came up with. Hopefully, it works out to our advantage and everybody is happy and all of those good things. In fact, here's what I'll do. I'm also going to give away one more free mobile opt-in, okay? So I'm going to give away one more free mobile opt-in. Here's how you can win. Because um, I'm going to test. I'm doing another Facebook ad test. So I need your comments, but I only want you to comment if it's relevant, please, okay? So uh, I don't want you just spamming my Facebook page. Um, go to my Facebook page. You can see it right here, go.bsc.com forward slash Facebook. And before we get off this webinar, or this webinar tonight, leave me a comment on this post. So check this post out right here. It's like the second one down. It says, is it hard to earn eight figures? I do not want you to talk about mobile opt-in on the post. This is for our ambassador club. If you're a member of our ambassador club, tell everybody how, what you think about it. If you're not, then just tell everybody if you think they should join my training. That's really all it is. It's an invitation to a training. Tell them, if, how, do you give me two stars or 10 stars, <laughs> right? Four stars or 10. Should people join my training? Um, you can do that right on my Facebook page, right here, go.dsc.com forward slash Facebook. And I will give this away at the end of tonight for free to one person who has liked, shared, and commented on it, okay? So like, shared, and commented. If you end up enrolling and I pick you, then I'll just refund you. Is everybody good with that? Just say yes if you are. All right, lots of yeses coming in. Very good, so you got plenty of time. Go leave me a comment. All you gotta do is find this video. It only works on this one. So likes, shares, comments. Remember, don't talk about mobile opt-in. This is about the ambassador club. It's about my training. So tell people if they should join my training or not. If you say no, I'm not going to delete your comments. So you can feel free to be 100% transparent and honest on 
that training, okay, or on that post. So do that now, and I'll uh, I'll hop back in here. I'll show you guys how you can how you can get enrolled in this in just a second. So back when we did this, we had some really cool success stories come in. Bree Bree was the, one of the first people to pop up and say this worked awesome for me. Um, I'm not going to go through all that hoopla about testimonials and stuff. You guys can see I was communicating with her. It worked really well. She got 38 subscribers, but four orders. What I want to be very clear about, okay, all right, what I want to be very clear about is that she got four sales out of only 38 subscribers. Do you think it's because more people open her emails and click? Like I said earlier, yes or no? That's where the real power is. It's that people are clicking more, which makes more money. It almost doesn't matter matter what the opt-in rate is, right? Um, after 24 hours, she got 56 subscribers and five conversions. That's insanity because she was selling a product. She wasn't doing lead generation, right? Um, she was actually selling a product, okay? Um, email marketing, some people are new to our webinar and they say it doesn't really work. I mean, look, this is one of Adrian's accounts for, uh, you know, for uh, e-commerce, $3,000 in sales with email marketing. You can see that all of this traffic was mobile 63 percent of it and this was a year ago yeah well 2016 so uh but i mean it was january 2016 um 63 percent and then you can see like i mean i generate commissions all day long mailing and you guys see i don't sell other people's products to you when was the last time you see me send a bunch of emails saying go buy other people's stuff i don't do it i'm doing what i'm teaching you to do i'm promoting like cpa offers and different things like that and that's where i make a lot of my money right so with mobile opt-in all right tonight you're going to get all the stuff that i've always given away all right so 400 templates there are 400 templates in there by the way um all of our stats our split test engine our url redirects the hosting you don't have to do all of that so you're going to get everything that we pretty much put together for you already okay so all of that stuff will come with this uh, when you when you get enrolled, all right. So super simple. Um, I pretty much feel like this is a success formula. This is the formula I've been teaching you guys in the Success Connection for a long time: getting traffic to your landing page, sending emails, making money. This is our profit cycle formula. How many of you believe in the profit cycle formula now? Just say yes, right? I mean, before tonight, it had nothing to do with tonight. The profit cycle formula is the way to go. I see a lot of you are probably posting on Facebook right now. Allow me to go take a look. Um, and I'm gonna pick our winner right off of Facebook here before we, uh, before we jump offline, right? So before this, this webinar is over. So if you've, uh, if you've left me some comments on that, you will have the opportunity to, uh, to get that. So some of you are asking about the link. Um, I can't pull it back up. It's just on my fan page. And you'll see a little video of me sitting in here wearing this shirt because I filmed it a few minutes ago. Um, looks similar to this right so it's got this little video going so right now we got 25 comments and 44 likes and shares i have no clue how we got more likes and shares than we do comments uh but you need to comment in order to qualify to win like i said i'll give you guys uh even if you happen to buy mobile opt-in at the end i'll give it to you for free or i'll refund you um so I'm gonna open up access to this, but I am gonna close it. I'm, I'm not gonna do it on all night. This is not supposed to be a big sales pitch. First of all, how many of you feel like you learned an awful lot about the mobile process, the way that people think, and all that good stuff tonight on the Success Connection? Just say yes, okay? Very good, so I see lots and lots and lots of people saying they've learned. That's my number one. I could care less really about everything else. Um, that is my number one most important Thing is to make sure that you all feel like this was the best time you could have spent, the best thing you could have done um, for yourself or for your family um, on a Thursday night, right? So awesome, I'm, I'm super excited about that. At the end of tonight, after I open up the enrollment here, I'm also gonna give you guys access to the free ClickFunnels funnels if in fact you don't have those already. So if you're new, you're gonna get that for free tonight. And I'm gonna go on and tell you what we're doing next week. Because once I open this up, there's gonna be a lot of questions and a lot of people. How many of you already know what, like, it's not like a secret, mobile opt-in's been on my page forever. You just need to use tonight's link or be on this webinar in order to get my bonus. But how many of you wanna get mobile opt-in tonight? Just type number three in, all right? So I see tons and tons and tons of threes, and you all are probably already know what, 
what mobile opt-in calls is not like I hide it, it's on my site. But I want to tell you before I open it up, I want to tell you what we're going to do next week. So next week, I am doing a giveaway that I've never done before. All right. I am going to give away a one-on-one, one-on-one -on -one mentorship with me. I've never even done this before, like ever, period. I'm giving away a one-on-one -on -one mentorship with me next week. You will either have the ability to A, fly to Mississippi, okay, and I'll work with you, or B, I will do it digitally uh, just on webinars. One-on-one, -on -one, completely free. Everybody asking, how can you win? All you got to do is be there. That's it. All you have to do is show up. When you show up, there's no catch, no trick, no gimmick. You just have to be there. I've just decided that I want to take one person and see how much money I can make. And so I've never done it before because I'm super busy, as you all know. But I'm going to do it next week live. You will have to be on here live. And I will pick one person to get that. We will also start our mobile domination workshop. Okay, we're going to talk about things like Instagram traffic. Okay, I've been playing around with Instagram. I can show you some really cool stuff. Instagram traffic, how to find offers for mobile, like the things that actually are going to make you a lot of money with mobile traffic. Mobile domination starts next week and it's completely free. And not only that, oh, by the way, I'm writing on my own note, note pad here. It's not on the screen. And I will be giving away a one-on-one -on -one mentorship next week, completely free. I have never even done one-on-one, -on -one, period. So how many, what do you guys think the value of one-on-one -on -one with me for, we'll say, I don't know, call it, if we do it digital, you know, a couple days of getting on, you know, whatever. What do you think it's worth? People saying $100,000. <laughs> My wife would beg to differ. She would say, send him away for a week or two. <laughs> she needs a break. No, yeah, I mean, I don't know what it's worth. I'm not going to ever sell that because I don't like to sell myself, but I will give it away for free. So next week, that's what we're doing, okay? All right, let's see what we can do. I do believe that mobile opt-in has always been the missing piece to people and their, and their success. I really do. It was the missing piece for hours when we started doing, using it. And we've tried a lot of things and it didn't work. And we were always marginal. But when we got mobile opt-in and we, when we built it and we got it kind of built out, we started crushing it and killing it. And that's why I believe that it really is one of the best things that you could do. Now, of course, if you're not a student of mine, you would get this bonus. This is from back in the day. Um, you would get the Success Connection webinars. We already know that. Um, I have no clue to do there. Okay, so, uh, but we also have a training in here which we've updated. Uh, from my brother Adrian, who teaches some Facebook ads. So this is one of the bonuses that I give you inside of Mobile Opt-in. I didn't show you that tonight, but it's in there. Um, Adrian has done some crazy stuff. These are some of his stats from even a couple years ago. Just hundreds of thousands of dollars in traffic. Um, and we, we've optimized that for Mobile Opt-in. So his training in here is specific to Mobile Opt-in. You'll get that for free. Um, you know, he's generated millions of dollars with mobile traffic, and this is one of the ways he's done it. Um, I'm also giving you uh, Google training with Fred Lamb. Some of you probably know who Fred Lamb is. He filmed this, this training for me a couple years ago, still applies today. I actually used this the other day when I tried to do a Google campaign because I had not done one in forever myself. And that I went in, I was actually in mobile opt-in looking around for this, and I went in here and used the training. Um, but you get this this session with Fred. It's completely free. It's included in here. So you get all these different things, right? Um, so you get all of these things, and you get them completely free. Uh, but in order to enroll in Mobile Opt-in, what we have is um, when we when we decided we were going to launch this, we we dropped our price down a thousand dollars, and we said we were going to go up to three thousand dollars on it. I never actually went up to $3,000 because I never actually sold it again, <laughs> right? How many of you realize I haven't talked about mobile opt-in in two years? It just isn't something, I did it once, I didn't really want to, uh, I didn't want to, you know, constantly be just barraging uh, people with the same stuff, so it didn't really make sense. So anyway, we cut the price down, and the enrollment to use mobile opt-in is one, it's a one-time fee, 
and it's a one-time fee of $1,997. So probably most all of you already knew that, all right? It's not like that's a quick trick type thing. It's live all over our website. I put the, uh, the URL in the box. Now, here's the thing. When you get mobile opt-in tonight, first of all, I'm going to take a list of everybody currently on here. You're all going to get my, my workshop series next week on the little offer that I'm doing right now that makes $6,000 a day. You're going to get it. Anybody that joins tonight will also get it. I'm also going to hook you up with some of the bonuses that we put together. We have some traffic training in here from the Traffic Experts Academy, uh, which is a little series that I did on nothing but generating traffic. It's inside of there. You'll get it free. You'll also get my templates. So all those templates in there, not everybody got those when we originally did this. Um, but these are a bonus that I put in later on. They're my templates, you get those for free, and you get Adrian's templates for free. That's all the e-com templates. So essentially what we're doing is giving you all the templates, all the training, all the coaching, everything you need, and you get it for free. But here's the thing. We are, I am, it's late at night, and I'm obviously tired, and I won't, I don't lie, look, this is my dad's nurse saying, hey, Mr. Rogers, 9 p.m. medicine is not in his pill box which means Anthony can't stay on here for a long, long time um, because I have to get my dad his medicine. So that's not very good. Um, I will have to take care of that. So I'm gonna open this up for 15 minutes. And in 15 minutes, if you have enrolled in the next 15 minutes, I am going to give you the bonuses that we talked about tonight, okay? So you will get all, of, and that would include my training. If you're already in mobile opt-in, please don't buy it again to get the bonus. You're going to get it anyway, okay? Nick is gonna download a list of everybody that's on this webinar tonight, and you're going to get those bonuses for free. So if you order it tonight, you're gonna to get it for free in the next 14 minutes. And if you already have it, you're gonna get that bonus for free. Does everybody understand that? Just say yes if you understand that, okay? So I'm gonna give you my $6,000 a day campaign right now. I'm gonna show you how to build it out in your mobile opt-in account. That's the reason why it doesn't make a lot of sense for me to give that to anybody else because if you're not using the software that I'm building it in, then it probably doesn't make as much sense, right? Uh, for you to do it. So that, is that right? Type, type number one in if you're getting mobile opt-in now I, because a lot of people have it and that's great. So all of you are getting that bonus from me for free anyway. But I see Lee, Dennis, Tom, Tony, Michael, Larry, Marcus, my dogs sound like they're getting it. Uh, so I see lots and lots of people. All right, if you have questions, put them in the chat box for me now because if the dogs, they're crazy. Put your questions in the chat box so I can answer them for you now, okay? All right, let's see. I'm going to try to move this around here. All right. If you already have Ambassador Club, do you need Mobile Opt-in? Mobile Opt-in would help you make more money with the Ambassador Club, yes. Um, so it's not the same thing as the Ambassador Club, so yes, it would. Um, Marcus says, what about a really small list? Well, Marcus, the, the most, here's the thing. This builds your list. So if you're building your list, then it makes 100% more sense, right? If you have a small list, this will help you grow your list and grow it right. Um, Kelly says, what day is the workshop next week? Kelly, I'm thinking we'll probably do it on Wednesday, um, but I may do it two or three times just so everybody has a chance. And I'll also uh, put the recording in an email for the people that are on here. I want you to be understanding that I will not put it in the members area because it will not be given to anybody that is not already on this webinar, okay? So be clear on that. Um, so far, some of you are asking me who's in, Wayne, Mike, Wendy, Brian, and then my screen is kind of frozen. So um, let's see, kind of going through here to give uh, to give you guys. All right. So Deborah says, if I'm using ClickFunnels, will I have to use a different autoresponder for mobile opt-in? We're actually working on integrating it with ClickFunnels now, but we're integrating with a couple of other things that will get it into ClickFunnels. The answer is no. Um, let's see, somebody said Chloe wants mobile opt-in. That's true. Uh, let's see, got lots and lots of people asking me questions. Do I need to have an iPhone to use it? No, this is for, this is specifically for the other people uh, that are like say visiting your page or whatever. They will need 
uh, an iPhone or an Android or a mobile, whatever, you know, mobile device. Um, Marcus says, just got it. Very good. Philip says, I'm learning. Thank you for awesome content. Lee says, "Works. will it work with my GetResponse account? The answer is yes. It works 100% with GetResponse, Aweber, um, Active Campaign, Zapier, all kinds of stuff. Um, can you make a thank you page with mobile opt-in? You can if you want to, yes. Uh, Troy says, I just got it. Congratulations, Troy. We have 10 minutes left. Um, Nancy says, wait, I can't use it with ClickFunnels. Yes, you can use it with ClickFunnels. That's no problem. Um, we just use this as a way to get our mobile traffic moved over. That's all. Uh, by the way, for those of you that are trying to enroll, if your card is declining, I see some of you, um, most of the time, yeah, it just, it's your bank, probably because it's so late. All you gotta do is flip your card over, dial the number that you see on the back of your credit card, and ask, and just tell them that you're enrolling in this, that this is something you're trying to do, and, uh, and then try to reorder it again, all right? Um, yes, one second, I do. Somebody asked me about this, uh, well, Q&A. You can tell I haven't paid any attention to this PowerPoint. Check this out. Somebody asked me, what will you give away, right? Well, what we did was when we launched mobile opt-in, we didn't have this, but we put together some done for you workbooks, right? PDFs, eBooks that you can give away. And we've already got templates built out that have these on it. So if you're trying to build your list and you're, you want to go into a different niche, or maybe you just simply don't have the specific type of ebook that you want, or maybe just a guide for how to get an ebook that's proper, I give you these ebooks in here. There's 10 of them that you can download in your mobile opt in account and you can give those away. Does that make sense to everybody? This is a bonus that I put in like probably a year after we really finished it. Um, I gave this to everybody. So I want to be very clear with every single person on this webinar. We got nine minutes left and then I'll be closing down my, my bonus and closing this thing up. Here's the thing um, all of you that have mobile opt in, you, are, you already have all these bonuses, you just may not have logged in and looked, okay? So if you've already got mobile opt-in, they're inside of mobile opt-in. If you go to the support button and you look at the help videos and stuff, I put them inside of there for you. You probably just haven't clicked around. Um, Joseph, the answer is yes, give me one second. If you, if you get mobile opt-in tonight, you'll obviously get the bonus, okay? So I wanna be very, very clear. All right, that if you already have mobile opt-in, please don't buy it again. I've seen four people ask me if they need to buy it again. I would absolutely, positively, unequivocally never ask you to buy the same software twice just because I upgraded it. One of the promises that I make with all of my software is that if you buy my software, my courses, or anything like that, you're always gonna get the updates. You're always going to get the upgrades. Well, if you read down there, it says, no monthly fees, access to all updates, right? Like, we don't want you to have to go and pay for more and more and more and more and more and more and more stuff, right? Um, Laurie says, why do people already have this if you haven't talked about it in years? Well, Laurie, um, one of the awesome things that happens here in our community is that I have students on this webinar, probably four or 500, that have been with me for years. On here, <laughs> yeah, Paul says we are loyal to Anthony. Jim says we got it a year ago. Um, I'm one of those people. So no, I haven't been talking about mobile opt-in in a long, long time. Um, Jeff says I've been here for two to three years. Uh, DJ, I remember DJ, what's up DJ? Says I got mobile opt-in on August 16th, 2015. So that's how long ago it was that I was talking about mobile opt-in. Um, so it's one of those things where, you know, um, I don't, I don't go and pound my students to buy stuff. I kind of let you make your decision, right? Um, Mike, yes, we're looking at doing that, but you can also use Zapier to get there. So um, I, got about, I got about six minutes left. Is there anybody else that's still trying to get enrolled? Type number three in if you're still trying to get enrolled. So I can, if you have questions or if there's a problem or something, let me know. But I gotta be pretty strict in my six minutes because I, I really, my dad's an hour behind in his medicine and I'm the one that does his medicine. So Arlene, Lori, Robert, Nancy, Misty. So for those of you that are kind of hanging out, waiting around, you could just go and take action now, get it now, fill it out now, whatever it is, because once we cut it off, 
that will be the cutoff on the bonus that I'm giving away. And I'll have Nick pull that immediately. So Nick, if you could do that for me um, right when I finish this up. And then I got to announce the winner of the, mo the second mobile opt-in account for free tonight, which is pretty dope. Um, and if you, if you happen to be one of the people that have already won, um, then I'll be, I'll just refund you. So, all right, sorry, that have already enrolled. Um, then I'll, uh, I'll just refund you. Uh, Karen says getting a 404. Karen, you're probably just going to the wrong address. It's uh, mobileoptin.com forward slash Anthony. All right, so mobileoptin.com forward slash Anthony. Um, we do have a flexible payment plan. I thought it was actually on the screen um, when I went to this slide. We have a flexible payment plan that you can use three payments of $797 if, in fact, you want to do that. Um, like to be extremely transparent and very clear. I'll put the link in the, in the chat box. We always uh, have this. Let's see, opt-in, Anthony Flex. Um, it does fall a little bit more when you do the uh, when you do the the three payment plan, right? So it's not as it's not the same price, um, but at the end of the day, you can get in for seven hundred ninety-seven dollars. So I think I have these links on here, so you can check this out. This is the final slide that I have, and I have five more minutes. So you can get in for nineteen hundred ninety-seven dollars one-time payment, mobileoptin.com forward slash Anthony, or you can get three payments of seven hundred ninety-seven dollars. Okay. And uh, you can get in right now for $797, okay? All right, so I see lots and lots of people asking me questions. Um, yeah, so I don't know. Can, I, can everybody tell me if the link works? Just say yes if the links work. Okay, because a couple people said the links don't work, but they do. So um, Martha, you must be typing in wrong. You're the only one that's saying the link doesn't work. Everybody else is saying that it does work. We have about four minutes left. It might also be that we just have so many people going to the page right now. So if you're trying to get on the page and it's not loading, um, it's likely just, like I said, that we just have a lot of people that are going there. Um, for some of you, like I think Jim and Tom, um, I saw that you guys had, uh, let's see, yeah, Jim and Tom, your credit cards declined. Um, you just, like I said, you need to flip the card over, dial the number on the back of the card, and then that will, uh, and just tell, you know, tell the bank that you're trying to make that, uh, this purchase. If you've tried to purchase before the next three minutes are up, when we wrap this thing up, I'll still honor it, um, you know, for our bonuses when you, when it comes through, because I realize you can't do much about credit cards not going through. Let's see. Going through, click the link in the chat box. Yeah, you can't click the link um, in the chat box. It's not like a click. Well, yeah, you can. You can click the link in this chat box, just not on the screen. Um, let's see. Um, just going through some of your questions. Uh, so Greg said, I have mobile opt-in. How will I be notified of the training next week? Very simple. I'll be sending an email to the people that were on this webinar, okay? So if you were on this webinar tonight, you will get access to that training. I'll be sending you an email and you'll get access to it. So be very clear that it will not include anybody else, okay? So nobody else will actually be getting access to this. It will just be the people that were on this webinar, all right? So I will be sending you that in your email. All right, just kind of going through. Troy says, already showing up in my, uh, in my account. Very good. Um, Lydia, no, mobile opt-in is not part of our ambassador program or anything like that. So let me be pretty clear because we got a lot of people that have a lot of different things. Mobile opt-in is a software. If you're in our ambassador program, that means you get the access to promote it which means you can make money from it, which is why I don't really promote it. Um, I let my students down, they can make money um, off of the promotion of it. So, if, but if you have that, that doesn't mean that you have the software, right? Um, the software itself is a software that you can purchase um, and use for your business, okay? Um, very good, I'm just making sure that, uh, making sure that everybody's on there. All right, 
I'm trying to make sure I answer all of your questions. Um, are there any monthly fees? No, there's not any monthly fees. Karen says, I finally got in. Welcome, Karen. Congratulations. And I want to make sure there's not people that are still trying to get in because we're about to close it down. So uh, if you are on the order form page and trying to get in, uh, tell me, yeah, it's a one-time payment. Um, yes, Mobile Optin will work with the Ambassador Program Funnels. Um, am I giving another copy away? Yes, I am in just a minute. Uh, I'm going to be giving it away to somebody that commented on that Facebook post for me. Um, so I will be doing that uh, in about 60 seconds because uh, I'm wrapping things up. So why don't I do that? If you want to get in, you've got the links. Um, we'll leave it here while I go and I give away a copy real fast. So maybe I can just uh, pull that over there and then go back. Let's see. Um, so a lot of you should have, if you're on the order form, um, you've got about 60 seconds or so to get your order in while I give this away. And then we will be wrapping things up and uh, looking forward to next week with the one-on-one -on -one mentorship, which I think is going to be dope. And I think you guys are going to love it. Uh, somebody's going to win. Somebody will be able to, uh, to come hang out with me here or just online uh, either way and, uh, and be able to get some really good training. So let's see. All right. Look, this is like on fire, I guess. All right. So we have this post down here. I'm going to give you a second to leave me some comments on it because I know I didn't show it up. So um, here is the post right here. All right. Um, it's, some of you didn't see it. It's that post. And there's the website address to go to, go.bsc.com forward slash Facebook, all right? So go.bsc.com forward slash Facebook. And I'll be able to pull this up here, I believe. Probably gonna make, a, make my computer mad because um, it's very hard to get the comments to load on here. It's like a nightmare. So this is the, the post. And there's the link. And if you want mobile opt-in, kind of like there's the, oh, there's the URLs. So you kind of have all three things <clears throat> on your screen at one time. I know that's kind of crazy, but you can, you can kind of do all three. All right, so I'm going to look now so we can hook somebody up with a free mobile opt-in account, all right? What would you guys rather have, a free mobile opt-in account or cash? Type it in the chat box. Free account or cash? And somebody said both. All right. Well, obviously, if you already have mobile opt-in, then I'll, I'll, give you, uh, I'll give you cash. Because clearly, I'm not going to not give it to you, okay? All right. So here we go. Let's do, our, let's do our giveaway right now. So you've got a few seconds to get it on here. Here we go. All right. All right. So you can see I'm scrolling through. There you go. On on my phone, it's a lot easier. It doesn't hang up every two seconds. Okay. All right. Yes, I'll be giving you the keyword and then the link to your free funnels in just a second when we wrap things up. And of course, until we wrap things up, you guys are able to um, able to get in and uh, and get some things done. By the way, there are some of you that are just like. I want to be super, I'm trying to be like real, you know, super respectful. Um, but don't just keep trying to repeat your order if it doesn't go through. It's probably your credit card company. Because um, I've seen, not that all of you are doing this, but Lynn Miller, Elaine Maxim, Ray Dunbar, Vivian, uh, I guess Heeman maybe. Um, some of you might have ended up getting your orders to go through, but for the most part, you guys weren't able to. Um, again, don't panic just because uh, it didn't go through. Just flip your card over and dial the number on the back <clears throat> and tell the bank, and then come back and replace your order once they tell you it's okay. And uh, if you've already gotten into this point like this, then we'll honor your order no matter, you know, if it comes in tonight, we'll honor it, right, for our, for our bonus. So I, I just wanna be clear so you're not freaking out just pressing submit five million times when you don't have to. Uh, um, all right, so here we go. Sorry, my throat is killing. All right, time to give away a mobile opt-in. Let me I'm loading all of them. Okay, so you guys can see this. So we're gonna load load all of these. Um, 
for some reason it hid some of them. That's another good reason to uh, to have it on your phone. All right. All right, here we go. So all of it's on here. Well, some of these are still hid. Sorry, I want it to be fair. Facebook just hides posts. I don't know why. Like none of you said anything. I think it's just because I got so many posts at one time. They just like hid the posts. It's really crazy. Okay, now I got it. All right, here we go. We'll roll this on through and go through. And my we are landing on. <laughs> it says. Man, I'm sorry. Amy Hernandez Rodriguez. You can see that's where it landed. Amy Hernandez Rodriguez. I have no clue if you bought mobile opt-in or if you're on here, but you gotta be on here to win. Is Amy still on here? Amy, Her Amy Hernandez Rodriguez. Yep, Amy is here. All right, so Amy, if you'll put your email address in the chat box for me right now, we will hook you up with a free copy of mobile opt-in tonight for leaving us some comments on Facebook. You'll get them. You will, uh, we'll have your access sent. There we go. I got it. All right, Amy, I got your email address here. I will put it in my notes and we'll send you your access. You'll get access to it right inside of your Morrison education account. You should have it there uh, probably within an hour. All right, so within an hour, uh, maximum hour. Um, so again, some of you like Nancy Howard just tried to get in. Uh, please don't just keep submitting, just call your bank. Um, yours said, actually said invalid credit card number, so you may have just typed it in wrong. Uh, but most everybody else just says it's declined by the bank and it's an issuer decline. So uh, just flip your card over, call the bank and tell them you wanna make this purchase and then we'll try again and it should work just fine. All right, everybody go with that? All right, let's, uh, let's give away your free funnels and your password for the night. Um, so you guys can see, we don't have to have this up anymore. You have some free funnels, okay? If you're brand new to the Success Connection, there are free funnels everywhere. This is the free funnel page right here. Uh, tons and tons of free funnels. If you don't have click funnels, you can get it right here. Um, all of our funnels for our solo ad workshop are down here. So tons and tons of free funnels on this page. So how do you get to this page to get the free funnels? Well, the answer to that is a little easier than you may think. Uh, to get the free funnels, you just go to this website address right here. Okay. So it's go.vsc.com forward slash funnel. And the password and the keyword for tonight, I think I wrote it. the password and the keyword for tonight is Boom. Now, you might be asking yourself, why did Anthony make the password boom? Um, I don't honestly know why I made the password boom. It's the first thing that came to my mind when I was sitting there was boom. And so uh, that just sometimes that's just how it works. So uh, the password is boom. Go.bsc.com forward slash funnel. The password is boom. That will allow you to, uh, that will allow you to get access to your free funnels. Listen, next week is gonna be a phenomenal week. Next week, we are going to crush it on the Success Connection. We're gonna be starting our mobile domination workshop. Somebody's gonna win a one-on-one -on -one mentoring with me, which again, I've never even done before. So this is pretty incredible stuff. Uh, definitely not something that is normal, right? So uh, I'm pretty excited about it. I'm going to leave my links right here up on the screen for about five minutes while I, while I close down, get all, get all my stuff taken care of, because there are quite a few of you whose credit cards have declined, and those links will expire that you see on the screen. They're set to expire at midnight after the, I always set my links to expire at midnight. Um, so if Nancy or Vivian or Ray or Elaine or Lynn or Jim or Tom or Matt or Paulette and the others whose cards have declined tonight, um, if you guys need a little time to make it happen and make it work, the time is there. I don't want to push, push, push on a bunch of you. Uh, wait, some of you are saying password isn't working? Let me look. Is the password working for anybody? Just say yes or no. 
What? Hold on one second. Good thing I look down. It will in a sec, but it should already be working. That doesn't make any sense. One second. Maybe I think I never actually edited it. I'm losing my mind. I didn't hit save. Hold on. Password now works. There we go. All right, boom will work now. I promise. Give it a try. Boom will work. Just say yes if boom is working. There you go. Boom is working. Uh, sorry, I must have just not hit save earlier. That's odd. Hmm. Must be the case. Okay. Well, hopefully you guys have enjoyed tonight. Hopefully you had a great time. We'll be back next week right here, same place, same time, on the Success Connection. We're going to be going over our mobile domination workshop. I'm going to show you how to crush it with some traffic, make some big money. If you got in on mobile opt-in tonight or you get in in the next five minutes before I close down the webinar, then you're going to get my free workshop series next week on how we're doing $6,000 a day in profit, building our list completely free. We'll give you the offer. We'll build it out in mobile opt-in together. I'll show you the exact steps that we're using so that you can duplicate what we're doing. If you're already a mobile opt-in, opt-in user, please don't buy it again. We will still give you that same bonus if you were on the webinar tonight. Um, and we'll also be doing our mentoring next week, giving away a one-on-one -on -one mentorship completely free. If you enjoyed tonight's Success Connection, leave me some comments on Facebook. Let me know that you enjoyed it. Let other people know you enjoyed it. And whatever you do, do not miss next week. Next week, I will be giving away the biggest value I think that I've ever given away on this webinar series, and that is mentoring with me, which I've absolutely never done. So with that said, guys, have a safe weekend. Have a fun weekend. And, uh, have a, uh, if you're celebrating a holiday, have a great time with your family and friends. I'm going to go get my dad some medicine. I'm going to leave this up on the screen here for about five minutes. If you want to take action, now is the time to do it. I will not be offering it with that training again. That training will not be put into mobile opt-in. So if you're kind of thinking about it and then saying, well, I'll do it tomorrow or I'll do it next week. And you can. Uh, there's nothing wrong with that, but I'm not giving that, that training to anybody that is not on this webinar tonight and enrolled tonight uh, because that's what I said I would do. I got to keep my word, all right? So take action, get enrolled. I look forward to helping you with mobile opt-in. I think you're going to love it. Make sure that you get your free funnels. If you don't have click funnels, get it. It's great. I use it. Eight figure rewards. You can have one too if you start using the right funnels and doing the right thing. And I'll see you all next week right here, same place, same time on the Success Connection. Take care, everybody. Good night.